Hey Tenors, I'm so glad to be with you here and sharing dreams and dreams with you. So we're going to do a note rehearsal and just kind of go, go through the piece and look at all of the entrances. Talk about little things to keep in mind as we get to know this piece a little bit better. And so if you've got this piece on a device in front of you or you printed out the sheet music, either way is great. We're just going to kind of go through each entrance and make sure that we have an idea of how this works. So your first entrance doesn't come until the bottom of page four when you are in response with the altos. So you and the altos are going to be in a little bit of a tight harmony going into page five. You start on the same pitches, but then you split into this second, which in context of everything is going to sound very nice. But we need to be just aware that you're going to be singing in a second with the altos. So let's just take a look at the bottom of page four where the altos are introducing or, or have introduced the first of the two themes. You get to do the second of the two themes in just a couple pages here. So let's look at the bottom of page four. The altos are introducing at measure 33 this first theme, one and two. to the E, two, three, one, two, down to the C, off, tonight, tonight, it's a lot all of a sudden, so that's where you begin to introduce the second of the two themes, right there at letter A, and I need you to come in forte, right there at the measure before A, and then you're going to immediately start decrescendoing on the word dreams. So everyone's going to be singing forte in that measure before A, big forte, which includes you. And as you start that second theme, and then decrescendo, okay? It'll be an interesting moment. So let's take that one more time. Bottom of four, I'll give you the alto line at measure 33, and then I'll bring you in with the altos, last measure of four, or last measure of page four. Here's the alto line at 33. Same note you're going to be starting on. So if you want to get your note from their held note on dreams right before you come in, perfect. Here it comes, one and two and you're in, but this is the alto part. One and two. Here's your note, two, three, one and two. and breathe. Two, three, one, two, tonight. Hold, two, three, move up. Two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Tonight, tonight. Pulling it back. One and two. entrance is at letter B where you are introducing that theme again just in a new key. So you're in unison. Everybody's together here. So we're going to have this nice powerful moment. Mezzo forte. Page nine. Measure two. Mezzo forte. Letter B. Here's your pitch. Two beats. One and two in your hand. So one and two. Hold fast. I'll give you one and a half beats. Here we go. One and two. Two. One and two, two, three, one and breathe. One, two, three, two, three, one and two. Double with the sopranos. 
toes nice and strong here. Two, three, one, forte. Two, three, one, and two. Two, three, one, and two. Let us see. Holding through a nice. Moving to the D there over that C chord. Okay? That's a lot to unpack. Let's go back for a moment and let's just take a look there. I think everything was fine, but let's just take a look at letter B, okay? Letter B and we'll take you into letter C and keep going, okay? One more time from the top of page nine, okay? And here's your entrance. One and two hold fast. Nice and low, huh. okay? You can see with everybody here. One and two. Two, three, one and breathe. One and breathe. Two, three, one and breathe. Hold fast two dreams. Two doubled with the sopranos here. Undoubled here. That D is all yours. Moving up. C sharp is all yours. Now. Holding that strong three step down. Two, three, one, two, three. And hand off to the violin. So the violin will take it from there. And you're going to take it right back from her at the top of page 12. What a terrible page turn. Who wrote this? So watch out for that page turn. You're going to take this. Holding that note decrescendo almost to nothing. Okay, so you'll hear the handoff. I'm going to play the bottom of 11 so you can see what's happening here. So the violin is going to take that. Two, three, one, there's your cue, that's your note. And you just take crescendo on that while the basses and altos finish the phrase. Okay. And let's go on to the last entrance you've got. So we're over on the top of page 13 now. 13, you've got the main melody that was introduced by the sopranos and altos in the first section, except you get to join now. So we have the first theme with the second theme's harmonization underneath it. So we're combining the two ideas here. So they just sang through it at letter D. All you need to do is sing through it down in your octave at your entrance, top of 13, last measure. Mezzo piano, dolce e leggero, sweetly and lightly. Everybody's singing in unison, but we don't want to lose that kind of very soft, folk tuny um, ethic that's going on here. Okay, D center, give you one and two in your end. Top of 13, last measure, here it comes. One and two. entrance right there is so it's the first notes that you sang of the melody you're gonna sing those first four melody notes again and hold heart same thing on the next page and then a nice ah for tonight let's do that one more time sorry about that slip so we're at the top of page 13 last measure okay and we'll take it to the end. Here it is, tenors. One and two and you're in. One and two. Everybody's together. Two, three, piano now. Two, three, one, and breathe. measures. And that's the piece. All right. Hopefully you have a little bit of a better understanding and a rehearsal video to reference when you would like to. Thank you, tenors. I'm so glad to be with you. And I'm looking forward to our virtual rehearsal. All right. See you later.